Tesla CEO Elon Musk says commercial space travel will be less than $1 million in the future. Let's see what it means. Welcome back, dear friends. This is Armin Haryan from TorqueNews.com. If you are here for the first time, please subscribe to our channel for daily Tesla news and ring the notification bell so you don't miss my next Tesla story. So Tiziana Selin writes in Science Times quoting Elon Musk and says, with SpaceX's Starship as the spacecraft of choice, Elon Musk plans to be the world's commercial space transport service in the future, taking people with the less than 1 million in cost to a city on Mars. The SpaceX CEO claims the spaceship is the best suited vessel to fly with human travelers to the red planet for many months. Using the groundbreaking Starship lineup, the Californian aerospace manufacturer and space transportation services, SpaceX will soon introduce humans to space, especially on the planet right next to Earth, in a report, in a report from INC.com. Elon Musk aims to cut off 99% of the price of space travel. Um, and he says that future space flight prices will be cheaper, said Elon Musk. Um, the CEO of SpaceX, Elon Musk, took his space travel dreams and outrageous plan to be the first resident and leader on Mars, um, of Mars to Twitter. Musk replied in a thread to everyday astronaut who compiled all Soviet rocket engines uh, agreeing to the ship part and expressing the same fascination, saying, literally months and months of work have gone into this. I think I finally finished the most complete family tree of Soviet rocket engines I've ever seen. This video is going to be ridiculous. I can't wait to teach you what I've learned. To this, Elon Musk responded saying, the most amazing thing about rocket engines is that they sometimes don't blow up. The amount of power going through them boggles the mind. The thread went on until another Twitter user questioned if SpaceX's Starship will manage to charge less than $1.5 five million dollars for the company's single space launch. Elon Musk reveals the petrol alone will already be five hundred thousand dollars and the rest will be for the marginal cost of delivery. So the question was from uh, Pranay Pato saying is Starship still aiming for launch cost below 1.5 million out of which five hundred thousand would be fuel uh, propellant cost? Elon Musk responded on November 17th saying, yeah, looks like marginal cost of launch will be less than $1 million for more than 100 tons of orbit. So it's mostly about fixed cost divided by launches per year. The amount would now cover more than 100 tons in orbit. And if there were to be commercial space transport, it would be the estimated price. Another Twitter user thought shares his curiosity about the future of SpaceX starships. Elon Musk sp said, SpaceX plans to have a multi-planetary life. Next destination, city on Mars. We don't know what that city will look like, and we don't know what the name of the city is, the city on Mars, but recently I think Elon, you guys have seen that Elon Musk has shared a, uh, he, he had shared a, uh, um, uh, the flag of Musk uh, uh, saying that this can be proposed flag of Mars, which kind of was nice and, and I kind of liked it. So, uh, Twitter user Peter Hogg questioned Elon Musk about the space industry's biggest unanswered question. The issue releases, uh, relates to the prospect of discovering space in the next 10 years. Musk's tweet was quoted by the Twitter consumer wondering what to do with the details. Okay, here's what the question. Uh, Peter Huck said, biggest unanswered question in the space industry in the next decade is what the hell to do, uh, what to do with this capability. It's utterly transformative. Quoting Elon Musk who said, yeah, looks like marginal cost of launch will be less than 1 million. But then Elon Musk responded to this saying, 
It's designed to make life multi-planetary, otherwise extreme overkill for mere Earth sector activity. Starship fleet mass to orbit per year will be more than 1,000 times all current Earth rockets combined, including Falcon, necessary for a CD on Mars. So, as Science uh, Times reports, life is planned to be multi-planetary. The SpaceX CEO responded and said that the SpaceX will be the hub for the potential probability. According to Elon Musk, there would be a huge challenge awaiting the venture, however, and that would be the mass to orbit each year. Elon Musk even teases a town on Mars, something that the CEO originally pointed to as voicing his curiosity in the Red Planet in one of his comments. In addition, Elon Musk's SpaceX is now the launch partner and maker of NASA's Commercial Crew spacecraft, one of the leading commercial space transport, project, uh, transport projects in the immediate future. So, uh, uh, yeah. uh, if you look at the inc.com Inc.'s uh, article, which is titled Elon Musk says he can cut 99% off the price of space travel and uh, explains how from 152 million uh, to 2 million to see the stars, he's practically giving it away with that cost. And uh, uh, Inc. article says Elon Musk makes plenty of big, bold announcements and um, in some cases they come true and other cases they don't now he's back at it with a big claim about the future of space travel speaking at the u.s air force space pitch day this week musk said he believes spacex is reusable 100 passenger starship will only cost two million dollars uh, per flight to operate in space he said according to space.com that the cost includes nine hundred thousand in propellant to get into the earth's orbit and an additional 1.1 million in operational costs so it takes nine hundred thousand dollars to propellant to get to the orbit of the Earth. It's a big claim. If Musk can really deliver a $2 million space ride, it would be dramatically cheaper than the $152 million. The average NASA space launch costs, according to data obtained by Futurism and earlier reported on CNET.com. In fact, if Elon Musk is right, his space travel could just uh, uh, be a little over 1% of what NASA pays to go on space. That huge, that's a huge, huge cut and uh, saving of public money. Musk has been one of the more outspoken proponents of using reusable rockets to reduce the cost of space travel. Indeed, his company SpaceX has built an entire business around the concept and with ambitious plans for passenger space travel and eventually he hopes fighting um he hopes to fight uh, uh he hopes to fly to mars actually launching reusable rockets to keep costs down and uh, that would be critical but getting down to two million per trip isn't the simplest of tasks and it's worth noting that musk did not uh, commit to a time period when he could pull it off so there was no time period but according to space.com spacex's current space trips cost between 62 million and 90 million depending on the rocket that's a far side from 2 million on starship spaceship a trip at the price point still has a long way to go before it is happening. Musk unveiled the Starship earlier this year. It's a big attractive vehicle that he hopes will one day carry people to Mars. He said that SpaceX plans to, uh, to launch the Starship into orbit early next year. By 2021, it could be ready to start transporting people. Uh, but getting to $2 million, it's still the, the, that's the important kind of number. When, or more accurately, if that happens, it could be the most important component, says INC.com, in SpaceX broader success. If the company can get people into space for a couple million dollars, the sky or perhaps space is the limit. If it can't, 
a race to getting to the cheapest space travel between companies like SpaceX, Blue Origin and others could be an interesting price war to watch because everybody will now try to get people to space in a um, less expensive way. What's clear to anyone, however, is that reusable is the key to humans finding a way off the planet. Musk is committed to it. Jeff Bezos with Blue Origin is committed to it. Now we just need to see which of these tech titans can pull it off. Um, we're hoping this happens sooner rather than later. Start savings for your tickets now, I guess. Ask science.com. Now, what INC reported was in November 7th. What I just reported a little bit ago was yesterday on September 18th, when Elon Musk now says that commercial space travel will be less than 1 million in the future less than 1 million in the future. What do you think, friends? What do you think uh, how Elon Musk aims to cut 99% uh, off the price of space travel? This is Armin Haryan from TorqueNews.com. I will have the links of both references in the description of this video. Please subscribe to our channel for daily Tesla news and ring the notification bell so you don't miss my next Tesla electric vehicle story. Have a wonderful rest of the day. God bless you, everyone, and see you soon.